Welcome to Talk of the Town. I'm your host, Carrie Dillon. We are joined by one of our media partners and somebody I've been getting to know yes. for quite some time now, Jim Buser from Sports Addiction and Old Town Bike Barn. Business is booming for you. It's crazy. This is wonderful. Yeah, it's, you know? it's, uh, we feel blessed to be able to, I mean, we feel like we're doing something for the, I mean, really. It's, You're it's, really doing something for the community. I mean, it's, it's it like. It is nuts. Yeah, it's a lot of people bringing bikes out from yeah. 20, 30 years, you know, yeah. hadn't ridden. Okay, so here's the deal. Yeah. What you can do if you have that old bike in your garage or you know somebody who does, you can bring it in and have it refurbished, right? right? You can have it all tuned up, which is yep. absolutely wonderful. Curbside service, doing the whole thing. Curbside service. Obviously. And then, you know, on top of it, well, obviously, you know, we're, we're taking protective measures. So right. We're say. Yeah. Only yeah. Two, two people in the store at a time. But the amount of helmets and locks and bells and mirrors and baskets and everything else we've sold in the last 45 days has been crazy so well, it, it's wonderful i mean yeah. there's 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 a whole approach to wellness that yeah. you all are able to really provide for the community so all right let's say you have one of those bikes in your garage right and you right. come in and it turns out that you've had it for years and your body might be different now you know oh, yeah. so you might need a different bike it's a lot of that going on so we do a sure. lot of, we've done a lot of trade-ins so we do trade in. So okay. if you have a bike that's worth something, and you, they're, like you said, that's perfect because the bikes have changed in the last 25 years. Yes. We're way more comfortable, yeah. way more, you know. So a lot of people have been doing that, bringing their bikes in. We trade them in, get them a new bike, or fit them up with something that works for them. Yeah. And you also have stuff that, that can help increase stability for oh, yeah. folks, you know, like the. the um... Yeah, we've got the trikes and the recumbents. We've sold so many trikes and recumbents because a lot of these people can't ride a bike now. Yeah. They don't have the balance or they don't want to fall. Or it, and so. that the anxiety factor. Right. I mean, that's kind of the buzzword right now that's going on with this whole as we're coming as we've been walking through the pandemic, as we're coming back into business. I think anxiety, you can put everything under the umbrella of anxiety, right? So right. when we're focused on wellness and people are getting back on bikes, the last thing you want to feel is anxiety. Right. You know that you're going to fall off your bike or that you're, you know, so you have the bells, you have the helmets and people who can find, you know, New get saddles, fitted for yeah. a bike. Yeah. yeah. Comfort while while you're riding a lot of saddles we've sold because saddles have changed too so yeah a lot of a lot of, lot of new bicycle seats yeah so comfort on good. the comfort on the old tush right yeah because yeah. that's the worst you don't want to ride a bike if it's not comfortable right or when you uh, get no, off and you no you, you don't so, <laughs> you get off the bike yeah. and you, you're in pain for a couple of days then, yeah you know? but we didn't like i said do you, we've been doing a lot of repairs and you know a lot of a lot of fix up it's been at times a little overwhelming so we've kind of yeah. cut back our hours so we're not running ourselves ragged like we were talking about uh -huh. i'd like know. to i'd like to bring that up i'd really like yeah. to bring that up because we are you've been offering a service throughout this whole pandemic right and right. and because we've wanted to help people keep their bodies in motion that that philosophy move a muscle change a thought you all have been there as kind of superheroes in helping people stay yeah. sane during this process right so you've had a lot of business there and as we're sort of coming back into opening the economy, so to speak, you all have been doing it the whole time. Right. So let's talk about this, how you're handling a lot of business and keeping yourselves from getting run ragged. What, you know? Well, I mean, it's tough because we have a few people that aren't working because of the pandemic. So it's kind of put us in that situation. But And, you know, we've been overwhelmed with business, which is great. Yeah. It's a blessing. It's a blessing. But, it's a total blessing. How do you, but we've cut down on our hours. It. We've we've cut them down. Yeah. Instead of being open eight hours a day, we're, we're down to six or five. Or if we have to even shut down at two or something just to get caught up on repairs or give my guys just a time to breathe and yeah. just relax. Because I can't get them run down because that's what we talked about before. You get yeah. run down. Immune system gets bad, you're gonna get this stuff. You're so gonna get this, and you don't it. want to be right. susceptible to this. So that's, I think this is a wonderful opportunity for you to be a messenger today. Yeah. You've been a messenger of how to stay sane during this, but also a messenger that, you know, anybody who thinks that we're gonna be back to normal or that, you know, waiting for normal to happen, normal is now. It's what we're focusing on, it's where we are right now, where your feet are, right? So right. if we have folks who are, um, let, let's, you know, compassion and patience, you know, right. we might all have different All these people hours. with these grocery stores and all these yeah. things that have been going this whole time. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah, you're going to help us get back on the bike, you know, yeah. but we need to be, now it's time to take care of folks who've been taking care of us this whole time. 
right? So let's right. be gentle as we go back into in, into uh, yeah, into business. you know, whether these restaurants because they're going to get overloaded, you know, yeah. these people need to be patient and yeah. know that these people, have, yeah. It's, let's be gentle. Let's start some gentleness here. I like it. I like it. I absolutely <laughs> like that. It was always good to spend some time with you. Yes, Sports Addiction, always. Um, right there at Oakety and uh -huh. Old Town Bike Barn. It's good to see you, Jim. Yeah, good to see you. Thank All you. All right, we'll be right back with more Talk of the Town.